All he said was close the borders. She said, where they? Don't, don't, don't make the kids learn gay stuff. I'm a lower the gas. Y'all get y'all cars and guns and all that. Protect yourself. If you want to have a small business, I'm going to help you get your small business. I'm going to get a black people some money and I'm going to give the low income neighborhood some money. He didn't do everything, bro. That's why I say it's one thing and one thing only. <laughs> the Hunger Games, brother. What has he said? I'm sorry for saying brother like that. <laughs> but what has he said? That I'm has sorry. been insane. <laughs> like, honestly, though. Like, what has he said that, that has came out of his mouth where you're like, oh, I'm Black jobs. I, I don't know if I, I agree with that, right. Trump. Like, has he said one thing where you say, oh, I don't know if I agree with that yet, Trump? No. no. So we believe everything it's, he's saying his is His policies, right. bro, because we look at the policies and we, we understand but, how they're going to affect Yeah, we're not emotionally looking into the situation. We're logically analyzing and trying to make a smart decision off of it. Oh, no, bro. This is just crazy. It's, me, just, bro. Bro. it's just like, how is he doing right and he's going to get killed? Because you know, that's just insane. I'm kind of happy that I, I'm not happy, but like seeing who the actual shooter is is a. Is that see that could be a? I don't know. No, because I seen so a, I seen the picture of the shooter getting like with his face shot. Like, I seen the video. Dead. That that was him. So if that was him, that makes a lot more sense that somebody that emotional really did something like so that. That's the a, they say his name is there. Thomas Matthew Crooks. It was a he she. It was a, yeah, it was, it was a, them or whatever them, whatever he was. He was an activist. Ran. He was Rainbow was Gang. It, it, was, it was Rainbow Gang, bro. He was part of Rainbow Gang. He was a trans. I just don't see how they let that happen, bro. And they <laughs> said he got, he had uh, credentials and stuff as well. See, that's serious. See, yeah, this huh? him. This him. They shot him straight in his Ooh. chrome. This look like a school shooter. He does. And, and just to me, it's just, it's just like, it's just so much because it's just, the fact that Trump isn't a politician and he stepped in and tried to do something for America because he felt like it was a broken system and people were trying to kill him and demonize him, bro. It's just like, is this, what do we want for this place anymore? Wow. You know, that's where I'm at with it. I'm sorry, y'all. But what they say it's actually two people that was a part of it right now. So I'm saying? We don't know. Oh, wow. It's going to be a lot of information that yeah. comes out, guys. I don't Let's know what I believe, bro. I don't know what I believe either. I feel like they scared. set it up and then they'll say it was this person, like the Michael Mex thing. It wasn't even that dude. They arrested the whole wrong dude and let him go later on. Let's get into so it. It's like, they said the FBI, FBI did that. That's what I'm saying. They point. just they just admitted to it. That's my point. That's what? great. Huh? Yes. You didn't hear that? The they FBI admitted, admitted to, it. to killing Michael Mex, bro, oh, and they oh, released okay, it. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah. And I was like, no, damn. Like, and they kept that on the right. They, say, oh, they, said, they said the same thing. The FBI killed him. Okay. They say he survived the gunshot and he was smothered by a nurse in the hospital, put a pillow over his face and killed him. They're scared of politicians. People that come in to be politicians that they can't control. Bro. They can't control. Well, the who's who controlling the system? Well, I'm gonna keep it hundred. Now that I see what the we dude kind of looked like, it makes a little bit more sense why this. Are we controlling him. the huh? system, guys? Him. Yeah, if that if that was him, but you see him get shot be, though. I, we honestly should have knew when they kept Joe Biden that they're, they're going to extreme lifts. Oh, Joe. Oh, Joe's okay. It well, it's matter, not guys. Joe. It's not. It's they can't kick Joe out because Joe is not trying to leave. Everybody's taking money from him. They're taking a lot of stuff from him. It's like nobody's supporting him in this party. He's still going to sit up there. And it's that's just, what it hurts my heart, bro. That's why he said, Jill, keep getting on my butt. Thoroughly briefed by all the agencies in the federal government as to the situation, based on what we know now. I have tried to get a hold of Donald. Uh, he's with his doctors. Uh, they Apparently, he's doing well. I plan on talking to them shortly, I hope. When I get back to the uh, telephone, look, there's no place in America for this kind of violence. It's sick. It's sick. It's one of the reasons why we have to unite this country. We cannot allow for this to be happening. We cannot be like this. We cannot condone this. And so and I want to thank the Secret this. Service and all the agencies, including the state agencies that have been engaged in making sure that the people who and we have more detail to come relative to other injured, other people maybe injured in the audience. I don't have all that detail. We'll make that available to you. I may be able to come back a little later tonight, but we'll put out a statement if we don't, if I'm not able to get if, if it's not convenient for you all. But the bottom line is. The, the Trump rally was a rally that he should have been able to can be conducted peacefully and without any problem. But the idea, the idea that there's political violence or violence in America like this is just unheard of. It's just not appropriate. And we, everybody, everybody must condemn it. Everybody. 
I'll keep you informed, and if I am able to speak to the to Donald, I'll I'll let you know that as well. But so far, it appears he's doing well. Number one, number two, that they're thoroughly investigating what happened to anyone else in the audience. I have we have some reports, but not final reports. And every agency, the federal crazy. government, I'll be, and I'm going back to, to my phone to speak with the federal <laughs> agencies that are being put together again to give me an updated briefing. Uh, as anything the happened, the they learned any more in the last couple hours. So thank you very much, and I hope I get to speak to them tonight, and I'll get to back to you if I do, okay? Assassination I don't know enough to, I, I have, I have, I have <laughs> an opinion, but I don't have any facts. So I want to make sure we have all the facts before I make some com any more comments. Thank you. He says, this is unheard of. Oh, it is, buddy. In third world countries, it is. Well, it's happened several times in America. Exactly. It's heard of, buddy. It shouldn't happen anymore. Yeah, no more. Like, it not be we still acting like we're in Russia or goddamn North Korea right now or fucking Palestine or motherfucking yeah. like, Iraq. That's literally what they're acting like. Oh, if Trump's the president, we're going to be held against our will and we won't have our country. They're acting like they're in Gaza or some shit. Like they're just held in an open air prison or some shit. They do act like that. Why, if he was already the president? That's what be pissing but me I off. But because the media, though. But I mean, but to I be mean, honest man. with you, I blame you, Joe, because you the Joe. stuff you be saying about Trump is the defensive part of everything we have seen. But, but let's keep and you say let's keep, keep us united. Right now, it's not, it's not Joe's fault. Though. It's not right now. It's not Joe's fault. They've been doing that though. They've been talking crazy about each other. But when it gets not to this, when you heard a, a politician call another politician a Nazi until our they generation, they call each other all types when, of things. When, we didn't when, pay attention before this. I, I, I know politics being getting dirty though. I never heard I, nobody called a, a, a Nazi. A politics Nazi being getting dirty, but whenever it gets violent. That that is insanity to me. So you telling know, me we, they, I, we had somebody that was up there as a president? They was calling him a whole Nazi. I Honestly, don't I don't think Trump. I know politics been dirty. Nobody plays by the rules. I don't, I don't think Trump or Vivek is crazy for saying we need to cancel the three le, three letter. Words, bro, that's my or, biggest thing, bro. Agencies now. Like how they they got multiple 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 charges. Strikes. But that's especially what, after the, the the documentary we saw. That's like that was the last straw for me, Loki. Like, bro, white boy Rick is it? White boy Rick? White boy. Rick, man, check white that out. Rick, on Netflix, Netflix, guys, it's Bro. pretty insane. They set up this white. Kid. We friends with the producer. FBI set up to this white kid selling uh, dope. Basically, the FBI, the FBI had a fourteen years. year old informant, and yeah. then when he was seventeen years old, doing what they knew he was doing, they gave him a life sentence. Yeah, and they, they were pushing him, him to do it. Thirty years. He had multiple opportunities to get out, to and they it. said, "Nah, bro, we need you." And then they gave him twenty nine years. They was but pulling him out of school. This said, is the FBI. They said the FBI got something where they could just shoot your ass with something nobody could see it and get your ass a heart attack. Hey, if they got that type of we power, need to be careful. If they have that type of power, they gonna, they gonna get you a leader. If we don't make no more videos one day, y'all. Well, Tell my mom I love. Yeah. Hold on, chill out. It's just insane, but we get we get backlash for speaking the truth. The president, we feel like he's speaking the truth. He's getting shot at. Then they it, it, like what, what that's showing you the truth. No. It, that shows evil. It really shows like that evil is really in this world. Oh, that, bro. bro, we knew that. Yeah. Yeah. No, especially just, especially on the internet when you see people praising exposed. that he praising that he's not dead, but man, wishing he's dead. Say why you didn't shoot an inch over. Trump is gonna win. Yeah, if Trump don't win. Seen, Well, that shit sounded like it was outside. No, that was definitely the that wall. That was definitely the wall. Jeez. Keep going. <laughs> I'm getting scared out you, man. Y'all always do that. Man, hey, man. Hey. Damn. It's our ups. At this point, whatever Alex Taj, Alex Jones Jr. say. Well, we wouldn't stop these niggas anyways. They would have bombed the house and then said it blew up. Yeah. From a gas. You think they'll give us a chance? Of course, it's... Trump is a Nazi time again. Let's deal with Hitler, okay? I, I don't think it's hyperbolic to say that. I mean, that is Mussolini, Hitler-like language. Trump's affinity for Hitler was always covered under an umbrella of his stupidity. Echoing Hitler's words. Listen to this. Well, Hitler was duly elected. That's right. Echoing the hateful rhetoric of Adolf Hitler. It echoes Hitler. And That's the kind of language Hitler used in Mein Kampf. That vermin and, and, and Hitler and, and that's, Lucy. that's a horrifying clip. That's a fascist clip. We're just going full on Hitler. It's from Hitler's Germany. We just need to say for the record that the term vermin 
was really effectively used by Adolf Hitler. Echo dictators like Hitler. With language evoking authoritarian figures like Adolf Hitler and <laughs> Adolf Hitler. Donald Trump parroted the autocratic language of Adolf Hitler. Talk about the brilliance of Hitler's generals. Correct. Kelly, yeah. CNN, when he got shot, CNN said he just fell. They didn't even say he got shot. For real? Yes. That's well, why Charlie, well, I what saying Charlie Kirk was so hot. He was like crashing on Twitter about that shit. He said, so, oh, so now he's just, he just fell. He said, man, this fake news is getting out of hand. What is this country even anymore, man? He's going to win now for sure. Bro. It's crazy. You know, it's bad. It's to the point that other countries in Europe are saying they need Donald Trump. To save the West, like everything in the West, because it's just Cause get to it. We're the we're the we're the standard. We set the standard. America sets the standard. He said America's the greatest country on the freaking planet. And this shit this type of shit should not happen here. Bottom line. They said they went too far with this woke shit, bro. I ain't never seen no like growing up, I never thought we'd see some weird shit like this going on in our generation. You know what made me think, bro, cause Elon was exposing I don't know. Where Elon almost got killed too. They had an assassination temp on Elon. Bro, look it up, bro. Why this happened right after the Elon donation? Kind of messing me up because Elon was exposed. I don't know if it was. I don't know if it was the United Nations. I don't know if it was the UN or what. But I think this side of the world where people were trying to control, I guess. The West, it was a certain group of people that was trying to control, and Elon was exposing them. I think it was the UN, something like that. Yeah, and Elon was exposing them, and they disliked that shit so much because he was exposed. A lot of people were exposing them on X and stuff like that. So I was starting to think uh, it is some, you know, Hunger Games type people running it, the situation, and they could be controlling the FBI. Like it's some controlling all this stuff. You know? The elites, as in far as Canada, you know, I'm thinking because it's just the world, the woke policies and the woke stuff is just going too far. On, on See, but I think the they're using world. that. They're using that to do something. You know, it's not like because they believe in that. They're using that to. Somehow they're trying to take over just or something. Like, the or something. Just like Andrew Tate said, the West world has went to shit. Why he loud? He went to the East. They got locked and up they, out there. They, exactly. They try to get they him banned too. Him and they, guess what? They they ban him off everything. They don't so want your, your best. They don't want us here. to fight. You see what I'm saying? Like that's what they. That's what the conspiracy is. No, no, they no, don't want yeah. us to fight. They don't want they don't strong want you to go men. against exactly, know? especially because. I feel like back in the day, you know, the elites were able to run things so easily without social media. But now people like Andrew Tate, not calling him like a patriot or anything, but like people like, you know, have regular people have voices and platforms now and they can go online and they can say things that are, are going to influence people. And they don't gonna, want that. Exactly. So they that's why they censor. Because they want to control but like, us. Why they really want to promote weak men? Like, that's what yeah. I just they been trying to figure. Because they know the we can't fight. They can run everything. We can't fight. They can run yeah. everything. Um, they can't control you. We live in like Wally man. World now. Then you got a group of them that's like, okay, so we got all the pussies, so we can just get them to do whatever we want them to do. Yeah. And whatever, whatever we want, what happened? Oh, they'll do whatever we say. Oh, they'll assassinate anybody. They believe in their. They believe in our agenda, hundred percent. It's yeah. scary, bro. You I ain't know? gonna lie. Like, but this look bad on Rainbow Gang now. Like, oh, it's oh, been right, looking right, bad right, for right, them. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. It looks bad on the FBI. What you mean? The dude that did was Rainbow Gang. It was hundred percent. Looks bad on Rainbow. Is that a, is that a fact? Bro, look up the bro. Look bro, up the dude. He's Rainbow Gang. Bro, he's Rainbow Gang, bro. He's a trans, bro. On, bro. I, don't, I don't think he was. Go look at Officer Tatum's ex right was, now. But he just posted it. Go I feel like it. that doesn't change the fact that someone, because to me, someone like that is not going to be able to just get up there and do that on their own. Somebody, bro. Somebody set that shit up and you can't tell me different, bro. He looked like he looked like a school shooter, bro. He, but I'm saying, you think he was that cold to where he could get up there and... I just don't, I don't see know, that, bro. I feel like somebody put them people, up to bro. that. It's these people, yeah, bro. bro. And that's the somebody thing, said bro. he's gonna like, like you said, somebody looked away. These things, he had credentials. Like, there's no way he did all that on his own. I won't believe that. People say that we pandering, and co I'm actually so serious about this shit. Either we're gonna fold and we're gonna look like goddamn Eur uh, Europe with the goddamn right, Queen in England and shit like that. Or are we just going to be the United States of America, guys? We got to choose one, and we have to choose. America Why would Donald Trump say fight, bro? Why would that come out of his mouth? Oh, he yeah, no, yeah. Why would right. that come out of his mouth? He knows what's going on. We have to fight. Fight! <laughs> fight! They, they really talking like that. Right, I, I got a question. I got a question. Y'all don't said. think, don't think this is. could cause a civil war in our country, bro? 100%, Stop. buddy. You said stop. 
don't say things like that, bro. <laughs> Nigga. I believe it. That shit crazy. That's some that crazy shit that, like, like right, what just happened. Hey, hey, what y'all saying ain't crazy no more at all. It ain't. I thought what he said was insane. I said, Tom, bro. That's insane. I me thought too. that was a thousand miles away. Bro, I can't say nothing no more, bro. I look him up. Okay. I couldn't believe it. Because, like, think about it. twice and told him, if, if June If June 6th happened and that was just him not getting, like, in office, you know, I ain't trying to call it, but, like, if both sides is being extreme like this, what's going to really happen in a couple days? Exactly, bro. And I'm scared exactly. for the election because if we look up and Trump don't actually be the president... Oh, man. And Tucker just, just tweeted something about the Joe Biden shit, like, how people are, like... Afraid for our democracy over Joe Biden being on stage. So imagine how people feel now. Oh, is this CNN? Hold on. Yeah, he wasn't. He this. wasn't. What did you just did you go on Officer Tatum? Did you go on Officer Tatum page? Yeah, he posted this picture. <laughs> he posted a picture. <laughs> <laughs> Nigga, yeah, we TV killing legs. No, he's not. They got his Instagram and everything. They right yeah, not with that gay shit. That's why people right. making memes. They about got his it. Instagram and everything right here. Hey, right, bro. I seen a lot of people say, I ain't with that gay Y'all shit. They dozing. The, yeah, hey. <laughs> y'all better wake up and smell a goddamn coffee this morning. Nigga, it's the FBI, you, you, dude. They try have, to make y'all think it's the, the other gang. It's the FBI, the real gang that really runs shit. Oh, they, they might be. Oh, it might be. It's either one. Either one. Either the one. The ones who got power. The ones who known for doing this shit. You think these little group of... That's come true. on, man. Y'all are so <laughs> damn naive, bro. Yeah, they no, kill all these leaders. Not they do what they want to do. They the tell guy, you what they want you to think. the guy they said it was. I hate Republicans. I hate Trump. And guess what? You got the wrong guy. Yeah, it wasn't him. He said LGBT. That's him. not him, bro. Well, I don't give a damn. It was it's, it was it's not, bro. You can't you can't say stuff like so that. Hold on, bro. We true. just seen a yeah. video of it's not true. true. We don't know nothing, bro. Yeah, so yeah, FBI, yeah, yeah, right, it's not right. true. Well, I don't know is this one of them agencies. That's what I know. Yeah, right. Yeah, right. Bro, they said they killed the dude, so that's not him. He just made a video. Bro, he's not. Yeah, bro. No, bro just, we just, just seen it. We, we see. just seen a video of a nigga oh, got shot in the face. Hold on, hold on. And that's not him. That's the dude that OT and them posted. He just said you got the wrong guy. Oh, that's not him. Hey, what are y'all talking about? He's not like all that stuff y'all saying is false. You can't you can't come on video and spread stuff like that. Hey, bro. Hey, they already doing that, man. It's over. We can't do that, bro. I'm sorry, guys. You want to be a reputable news source? We can't. Spread fake news, hey, guys. Catch me every like, time. I can't. apologize. The, like Joe Biden said, no, I don't believe we have that. an opinion, but we can't speak on it until more facts come out. That's the one damn good thing that dumbass man done said. <laughs> he called it Joe in his mug. <laughs> I gotta keep it 100. No, you did though. He did I gotta too, keep right? it 100. <laughs> All right, bro, let's go. Come on. Uh, I can't get on here and say some shit. This shit just bad, bro. Implying still on here talking shit. Bro, come on, bro. He's trying to get paid off Twitter because his music career ain't paying. Nobody listen to freaking Everybody going to think that shit going to be real funny until goddamn we look over here, darn, we in that goddamn chamber. And bro, we running. Stand, and, so, and I'm stop saying GD over and over and over again, yeah, bro. I'm please. Sorry. I'm sorry. People bro. hate that. And we sell Christian sorry, Burks, bro. that's like, it looks horrible. I'm, I'm sorry. Cut that out. But I'm saying, it looks bad. It does. I'm, I'm not. I'm saying G A H. No, it doesn't matter. No, still, no one takes it like that. You still, can't. Bro. You can't sell Christian Birch and say that. You can't. Yeah, you you can't. cannot do that, bro. Yeah, that's true. Okay. You can say every other. You can drop F bombs on it, but you cannot say. We that. don't think it's all fun and games until we on opposite sides in our arena and running towards them swords in the middle. All right, bro. Hey, the Simpsons went wrong. Why the Hunger Games wrong? All right, brother. All right, we, I, see, said, I, I, I said. I said. I like brother says, to bro. him being shot. I want to see what CNN says, bro. It can get real, brother. The rhetoric around him over the last few weeks that if he wins an election, our country will end, our democracy will end, it's the last election we'll ever have. These things have consequences, okay? I don't know what the motivations of this shooter are. I don't know any of the details. But I know the rhetoric around Trump has grown extreme. You mentioned some other violence. You didn't mention the Supreme Court attempted murder of a Supreme Court justice or the congressional baseball game where Steve Scalise was nearly murdered. Huh? One a conservative, the other a Republican. But we have people in this country who are dedicated to telling half the country that if Donald Trump wins an election, the country will end, Facts. the Constitution will, will go away, Facts. and so on and so forth. What I want to hear from all elected officials is this kind of hyperbolic extremism has consequences and it must end. Yes, we're all shocked, and yes, political violence has no place. Where does it come from? It's got to stop. But we're also hearing from uh, Trump very, very strong statements of condemnation of Biden, the worst president, the most dangerous president, and all of that. He's speaking very, very strongly against President Biden. Who's in the hospital? Well, we do. This is an assassination. <laughs> I, I, look, I, I agree with you. you. You say calm things I, down. I, 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 I agree. Both sides should calm this, things this, down. This, this moment is, if, if there was, if, if we... 
What other wake up call could there be for everybody in this country right now? I'm, I am, I, I am mortified. At, I mean, th- th- this will live on forever. These pictures we're seeing today will be in the history books of our children and our grandchildren. I mean, we're living through a historical moment, and we have to recognize it for what it is, and we have to change. You have to we kill the change. rhetoric on both sides. We have to change. Because it's really dangerous, and it foments dangerous. what we've what we've just seen over the past couple hours or so, and it's a really, really scary situation. You want to add a point, Dan? No, I, I, you just said it, Wolf. Um, I, Scott, your point is so well taken that the escalation of rhetoric is something that if you just look back in in history uh you the main bitch. it doesn't take a lot to um to dig and find that people take cues from not just leaders but from people around them the and uh when when violence happens sometimes things are uncorked and it is important for leaders across the board as we are seeing today yeah. To tamp things down. Is, is she has blood on her hands. Dana Bush, you have blood on your hands. It's You're cr- guilty. You've called Trump a Nazi a hundred yeah, times. Yeah, like it's crazy. They trying to say all oh, both sides. The shit y'all said about Trump is insane not, to what everybody what, compared hey, to. You guys. know what Hitler did? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's, a, that's, a wild that's a crazy thing. ass thing. The stretch there. That's a, yeah, that's a wild thing. <sighs> the threat to democracy. Like We're not going to have a country. Room, the the, the fact that loosely. the man almost lost his life today, bro. And they're still going to get on here and say, oh, both sides. Wake up and smell the coffee, mother. It's nothing we can do. We can't get this through these people's skull. So I feel like it's just they so they on their side too far. They just can't. It looks bad if they go. You know, if, if, but that's the thing, though. But that's, how far could you go, bro? What, what what human what characteristics do you have inside of you to just get online and say something like that? I mean, or get on TV and say something like that. Bro. The money is the root of all evil, my brother. Morals and a lot of things leave people. Well, behind. then we're hey, buddy. So guess what? Well, then no, what you mean? Well, I, I give up. Then. I give up. The whole a whole, a whole <laughs> politicians up. right now is is making hella bread, up, extorting people. You got Nancy Pelosi that's trying to send people to war and have her money in stocks and try to triple her stocks and stuff. Money so, you don't know, keep going. So, so therefore, we're done then, buddy. Yeah, stop talking about it then. It's Jesus over. is it's on sad his way it back. It's nothing we can do about it. You know, we just know shit's gonna get worse and worse. We're getting closer and closer to that time. I feel like, but I mean, this happened in history. This is another moment. Yeah, this in happened history. in history. Yeah, Ronald you know, Reagan got shot. So that's the last president. It's insane, bro. It's just insane. I guess we just have too many people, bro. That's the problem. Like, it, no country right now. I think in today's time is gonna be ran uh, amazingly because it's just. No, so I think the biggest now. problem. Three letter agencies, point blank period. Shadow government, the rhetoric being pushed. There's a lot of problems we have going on. I mean, they're behind all that shit. Yeah. Damn, bro. Well, Todd, you you should walk out of here with that plaque right now, buddy. (laughs) Hey, bro, Todd, hey, bro, like, he really, he was right, bro. He was right. That's insane. You know who else said it, though? Chris Tucker. Tucker, Tucker, no, Chris Tucker. (laughs) Tucker Tucker Carlson, yeah, he did, yeah. He said, hey, he he said the only thing left to do, he said stage three, the only thing left to do is... He was like, hey. So, therefore, people know what's going on. We got to figure something out about it. I think Trump's trying to figure something out about it, and this was their last attempt. Let's put it into that shit. To be honest so with you... God needs, is trying to save America, He needs some or, new people on his Secret Service team. He needs a new batch, because that was... Uh, it was undercover, bro. They didn't do it by accident. Bro, I'm going to keep it up. It was not no accident. You're not going to convince me of that. Nobody made no mistake. So everything went according to plan except for bro miss. I have to agree. I have there to ain't agree. no way that they just didn't see him to me. Somebody died, they let that happen. To me. To me. Well guys. Whatever, but I ain't I, I can't tell you can't tell me that that was just they just oh we didn't see him. This, this is crazy, man. I, I didn't think we was gonna I, I didn't think this was gonna happen today, bro. But well, we were in the new regardless when it was gonna happen. Guys, let us know what y'all think in the comments. It's going to be a long week. It's going to be a long month. It's, we got three, four months. When he gets in office, bro, that shit's going to be legendary, bro. Like, man, almost got assassinated. We watched this shit in real time, bro. Oh, God. Life is so different now, bro. Because it's like, they okay, they stole the election. That is actually, now, actually, it's a proven fact that they stole the election. Like, it's on document that they had some extra votes, for sure. Proven. Everybody, everybody, every senator, everybody. That's why a lot of people, like, what's he... Fully goes on video and says, "We well, we know now that they stole the election. It's 100% a fact. I don't know. No, they're not covering it. I don't you know. 
I don't know. Because but when the elites don't want that to be covered, it won't be covered. Yeah. Yeah. We seen it from that's why Elon did such a big thing, bro. We gotta put Elon did such yeah, a huge it, 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 thing. It's yeah, like he exposed bro. them for the censorship and everything. Damn. It did. Let us know what y'all think in these comments, guys.